Hey guys, today we're going to talk about how to wake marijuana like a professional. First things first, you need a good full scale, probably something to the uh, maximum value of about 500 grams. That should be sufficient unless you are planning to be a dealer of sorts, which I highly do not advise. This is really purely for pure recreational and medical consumption. First things first, you need your equipment. We've got a good cat tipper here to be able to assist us. You need something to probably capture the uh, marijuana just to ensure that we have good integrity in terms of the mess that you package. First things first, put the scale on. You'll notice it comes up, gets to a value of zero. So we need to put this on so that we compensate for the mess of our container. As you can see, this one here is approximately 98 grams. You simply press tear and there you go. You're right back to zero. You lift it up, it's minus 98. You put it back down, right back to zero. Make sure you can see that. Yes, you can. Perfect. Get your tipper ready and lined up and you simply just roll it back. Um, I would, uh, in fact, you know what? Let's get the sound. Let's get everything function, function just the way we would like it. I mean, you know, some days you have those days out there on site, ah, the equipment. And basically, while you're working, you need music of sorts. Um, our tipper here has got the sound effects ready for that. Okay, that was a major flop. Um, right now, let's maybe grab out some, how about 25 grams? Yeah. So, 25 grams, let's do this. Crikey, one time is up there. Got a go in there. Really making a mess of this, aren't we? Okay, more like an amateur professional, not entirely a pro professional, but whatever. That's why it's important to have a clean surface so you can simply collect your followers. We are now on 16.4. So, as you can see, we've got to 25. In fact, we've exceeded it by an entire 0.2 grams. That way, even if somebody else's scale doesn't entirely function as yours, you know if they, if you're sharing with your friend and they want 25 grams, there you have it, you have 25.5 for them. Now, the key part, you really truly want to do this. I'm sorry I don't have, like I said, I'm an amateur. Um, we don't have uh, fresh bags, but you simply take it nicely. You mind your truck out of the way, and you grab it, and you ensure you get every last gram in there. Every last one of them. Okay, I really should have truly used the bigger plastic with a bigger hole so you can simply just tip it in there, but anyway, I didn't. But nonetheless, this is horrible. It's not as easy as I thought it is. Okay, I see why some dealers sometimes end up in a situation where they've given you far less than you've actually ordered. And I'm trying to do this on camera with a very horrible cell phone. Please forgive me for the pure visuals. Oh, I'm gonna make sweet, sweet love to you, honey. This would be perfect for like a tea just before you sleep. Recommend you boil some water, grab some honey, how about a lemon there? Give it some good flavor and maybe some ginger as well. You simply warm it up, boil your water with dropping your ginger. Um, after boiling it, um, after boil, pardon. After boiling your marijuana in this water with the ginger, you simply pour it into a cup with a bit of honey and your lemon. Drink that before you sleep. It's phenomenal for the soul. That's all I can say. And your body too. See, oops, all in there. 
fresh and clean so fresh and so clean um i'm sure you want to verify is it really truly what i claim it is well moment of truth um first drop that back on there let's do this oh no let's drop that back on there right back to 98 grams we tear that put it back what do we have 27.7 do you want to know why because the plastic has added its own 2.2 see perfect and to ensure that whoever might be on the receiving end of this is entirely happy you just simply do this second perfect 